can do what I promise. Harper, time to get out of those wet clothes. No, I don't want to. I'm still learning all the rules. Who are you talking to? A friend. He's what you might call imaginary. <laughs> I know, adorable, right? Harper? Hi, Mommy! You know you're not allowed up there without me. It isn't safe! She's coming. X marks the spot. You're supposed to step on it. The crime scene. Clear signs of tampering with the treehouse. Are you telling me six year old did this by herself? Tell me about this game. I'm not supposed to say. Who said that? Who is this person? Yeah, I can hear you. Yeah, I'd like to play. They said grown-ups wouldn't understand. <laughs> what is wrong? What is wrong? What kind of stuff does he say? Lots of things. He says if I won the game, we were going to have a job. But... Was that word domination? I'm sorry, am I missing something here? Six-year-olds don't talk like that. Someone's coached her. I need to meet this friend. You really promise me. He's real, isn't he? I swear, but you know I wasn't the only one. Take a look at this. Jackson Bellings, age 10, one month ago, he detonated a homemade bomb. Subject believed he was under the influence of an imaginary entity. That's easy. The day the Baltimore Colts won the Super Bowl. Mr. President, if this is a hoax, then it's the most convincing hoax that I have ever seen. We all just afraid to say what we really think it is. Daddy, I saw what's gonna happen. That's when they win. 